Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel and today I'll show you how you can delete or remove the virus from your iPhone. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. So if you get a critical alert and you got the virus, let's say you're assuming you got a virus on your iPhone, the first thing that you really have to do here is go ahead and open up your settings on your device. You want to scroll down to uh, privacy and security there. And now, all I want you guys to do is just scroll over here and simply go ahead and tap this option called safety check. Now, all you have to do is just go ahead and just tap the emergency reset. So, what is going to happen, it's going to reset all the access from all the people and apps that you are or, or even it's going to review your account security. So, if you tap there, it's going to scan your face and just go ahead and just start doing the emergency reset. I cannot really do that because if I'm gonna do it, then my screen record will be off. So you go ahead and do it by yourself and after that, check whether it gives you any information or not. So let's say you've done it, but still it's not really giving you any information. The next thing that you have to do, just go ahead and open up your settings one more time. You just gonna scroll down to your privacy and security one more time. And this time around, you wanna scroll down here and simply tap the lockdown mode. Now, the lockdown mode is a really extreme features that will help you to protect your device from hackers or if anybody has already targeted your device. This will shut down every single connection that they might have already, or already have done for you. Just go ahead and just tap the shutdown mode. It will restart your device and your phone will be protected from cyber security or the cyber attack. So now just go and do it and see what happens and I'll check whether your problem is still there or not. So most likely your problem will be solved right after doing this. But still, if you have any confusion whatsoever that your phone will be attacked by somebody or someone, oh, then lastly, just open up your settings on your iPhone. And this time, all I want you guys to do is just go ahead and open up a general. And now just go ahead and, well, you can literally delete the important data that you might be thinking well can be really uh, problematic if it get leaks so out. So just go ahead and open up your, you know, like just open up your data and delete or share it, or just simply transfer it to other device. And after after doing that, um, just uh, open up your settings on your iPhone. You want know, to just open up general. Just scroll down here and tap uh, transfer to reset iPhone. Tap reset and tap that. Um, oh, sorry, sorry. So you go back here. Um, just simply go ahead and tap transfer to reset iPhone, tap erase all, and go ahead and tap continue. Now, I know it's going to be really hard and you might be thinking, well, it's crazy, but I understand you. But the problem is if you are not going to delete that data from your iPhone, the virus will remain in your device and it will, like, it will leak your information. If you're going to delete everything, including your Apple ID, like from here, it's going to be logging out. It can re-log in that later. If you're not going to delete all the apps and data from your iPhone, this can really actually harm you even further. So go ahead and do it. And after that, most likely the problem will be solved. And these are the thing that you guys can really do if your iPhone got attacked by an attacker or, or hackers from anywhere in the world. All right, guys. See you guys around.